Hey guys, I told you I'd show you that painting and I'm going to show you that right now. Just one second, I gotta go get it. I have it up over here. Look at this. Look at that cool acrylic look. So this is a, a back screen a desktop for my phone for the longest time. And yeah, it's nature and water and can you believe the person that made this is just beginning to become an amazing artist. So I paid her $100 for this painting and I feel like I <laughs> got a hell of a steal on it. So um, if you have dreams, you guys should totally like, you know, you should look forward and keep on investing in those dreams. You shouldn't just uh, stop doing what you're doing. Um, it's probably one of my favorite pieces of artwork. Um, not only because it was made for me, but it's, it's done by one of my friends, you know, so it's one of those things where you kind of appreciate them for what they are, you know, like, I, I can't even believe, like, the age. She has only been painting for not long at all. And I was like, how long did it take you to make this painting? She's like, oh, maybe four hours. <laughs> I couldn't do this in four hours. I'm sorry. Not to mention I suck at people. I cannot do people at all. Uh, I like to do abstract art, and I like to do... Um, I can't do people. I've tried to do people. <laughs> and they come up really, really bad. So um, thank you, Carly, for your, your, um, your painting and your artistic talent. It does mean a lot to me. And um, I haven't decided if I want to hang it up, if I want to frame it and put it inside of a frame. Because I was thinking about doing a um, kind of like a frame and then putting it behind glass. So like it looks a lot better. Like I have something to put it into, you know, or, you know sell the artwork for 10 times the amount that I purchased it for and have you make me another one and I'll pay another $100. Uh, I could be a, an art curator for you if you want. Um, yeah, that was all I wanted to show you was that painting. So um, yeah, I'm going to be doing some overtime. So I probably got to take care of things that I need to take care of. I did not do yesterday because it was my day off. I feel like when I use PTO, I, I want to be lazy and get paid for being lazy. And um, the only thing I did is I played video games and I was going to do my laundry and all this other stuff, but uh, didn't get around to it. So I might have to get around to it today. Um, if you guys want to play some zombies, let me know. I'll play some zombies with you. But uh, I'm not in the mood for Warzone today. So just to let you know. Uh, most people, most of my team don't even watch my videos, so I don't. I can stop saying that actually, because uh, by the time it comes around a year later, those are going to be obsolete. But uh, it is the first of March, so I hope you guys have a really good month. Uh, you can get your things in order today. Uh, nobody enjoys Mondays, but uh, I do. I thoroughly enjoy Mondays. Uh, I'm going to be working on Wednesday. And hopefully at the end of this uh, pay period, I'll be on a different shift. So we'll see what happens with HR and what they uh, decide, to, decide to do. But I know uh, Day Shift needs a lot of help right now. So hopefully they send me over there and I can uh, give my expertise or my efforts towards their team. And yeah, for the rest of you, uh, just have a good month. You know, have a good day. Take it one day at a time. Be kind to yourself. You know, stay cheerful and true. And uh, yeah, this is a short one, but uh, I really wanted to show you that painting and I'm going to show it again too, because I'm super proud of it. She's so good. I could, I love, I don't know what paint, I didn't even ask her what paint that was. I'm just, I was going to go find it somewhere. I, I, I imagine at Michael's because they have all the good stuff. Uh, that's where I shop at, where I get my painting and stuff I paint from. But uh, yeah, take it easy and uh, be nice to each other. Peace.